you pull up one. I see. I just straight pulled up the live, tried to let, let him join her, and he ain't even he declined it. Now I'm gonna try it again. And we waiting on you, bro. Stop playing with me. Y'all be playing question shit, bro. Stop playing with me. Exactly. Now, 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 since you declined it again for the second time, get the off my live. What you talking about? Stop playing with me. I keep telling y'all stop. Telling y'all stop playing with me. Like, stop playing with me. Y'all want to talk? Hop on live. Then we can, you know what I'm saying? Stop playing with me, though. Like, stop playing with me. I wish you can go live on Twitter. I wish it was some Twitter live shit. Stop playing with me. Uh, we got, I got, I got time. I got, I got about fifteen minutes till I leave out the crib. I got like fifteen minutes till I leave out the house. You know what I'm saying? I like this comment, but y'all still, y'all still promote the op. I'm gonna pin this comment so people can read it, but y'all still promote the op. You know what I'm saying? Y'all gotta just chill, bro. It'd be a lot that I be wanting to say. You feel me? It's a lot that I be wanting, like questions that people be having and shit. I'll be like, yo, I'll be having it. I got the answers to a lot. Be like, you gotta, you gotta understand. You gotta wait to the right moment to really like say certain things. You know what I'm saying? My, I, I can, I can tell you one thing. My, my team definitely make offers though. Like we definitely, you know what I'm saying? Like that Figueroa remake. That wasn't because of them. That was because of that was because of me. That was because of us. That wasn't because of them. You know what I'm saying? That was because of us. You know what I'm saying? And not only that, I only was going to fight Figueroa because I fought June 4th, Daniel Roman. And in the midst of that, I could have fought again before the year was I only fought one time this year. I could have fought again. But guess what? I was waiting on MJ Punk to see what's up with his hands so we can try to get it on. But once they, once they try and go different directions, it was like, all right. Well, I might as well get this fight right here real quick since, you know what I'm saying, running back with him. And I, re and we, and I got them to reach out to him. So, what's up? And that was before the end of the week. Like, before he was fighting Butler or whatever the case. This was months ago. You feel me? So, now when he fight him, now, was, now oh, he's supposed to already knew he, he was anyway supposed to move up. And it's like, yo, shut up. I don't get my pants to these, these guys. <laughs> I'll be the reason why I'll be running, like, why I'm trying to fight this person, that person, bro. I'll be like, come on, bro. Stop playing with me. Stop stop playing with me. Oh, yeah, MJ Soft, man. I don't care what nobody say. I was been, we's been, it's, it's, it's too much in the weight class. I hold two of the belts, you hold two of the belts. What the, what the, come on, bro. Like, what you waiting for, bro? I'm tired of people. <laughs> like I'm on that type of time, bro. Like I'm on. Like I don't get what I say. I'm just like people been getting on my nerves, bro. But the crazy thing is, is it's it's the fans. I'm not coming. I'm not saying it's uh, the 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 the, the, the Japan fans. It's the, the U.S. fans that be getting on my nerves. You know what I'm saying. I ain't going at nobody, but specifically who I'm going at. Like, I see. I, I feel like MJ trying. They they think I'm about to outgrow the weight class and move up, bro. Stop playing me like I ain't like I ain't got the WBO. Like I won't come right back down and and interfere with whatever you got going on. Like, and that's then that be my way of thinking. That's it. That's exactly why I didn't. I wasn't in so so much of a hurry to move up to 26 anyway. Cause I feel like they was trying to play. They like they they was trying to get over like. I don't know what he's trying to do, but I understand the uh the the injury with the hand. That's one thing, but you got thirty five mandatories, bro. Like, what's up? <laughs> like, you, you got you you fighting thirty five mandatories, bro. Like, what is you doing? No one thing about me, bro. I'm one of the nicest. I'm genuine. I pay for us all to go out and have fun. Okay, bro, we bet the fights, bro. I'm going to run down. And I'm not saying I'm going to kill somebody. I'm not saying that. Anything. But any of you bloggers, people, I see you and y'all said the wrong thing to me. And I feel that way about it. I'm going to approach you and wherever I have it go, it's going to go. 
you sue me, all that. I ain't gonna get nah, I ain't gonna, I'm what 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 Kodak said, that's prop money. <laughs> I'm broke. <laughs> that's prop money. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> you feel me? Watch your mouth though. Don't expect y'all can't expect to say what y'all want to people and then when somebody wanna retaliate, then it's all look what he did. Pull your camera phone out and you know then I'm saying look what he did, look what he come on, bro. I don't like people like that. I don't like that. So I had that same energy that y'all had on them socials when y'all see me. I'm not fighting not. Man, if I'm about to start with, with who did that? Deontay Wilder and somebody else. I'm gonna start inviting y'all. I'm gonna for how big you are. You could be two two ten. You say the wrong thing, you can come to the gym, we can glove up. And I, I guarantee you, you ain't gonna like what I got for you, bro. But we, I'm, I'm on that right now. And I'm strictly on that. You feel me? Shit, chill. No, but look, though, no, I'm saying a lot of people hit me, hit me up for interviews and stuff. I ain't been doing no interviews lately. Like, it's not, not nothing personal against nobody. It's just I've been needing some time to myself. And then only that, not only that, everybody be asking me the same questions over and over. It's like, I want to talk about something different, bro. Make up something. Talk about my life. What the fuck I'm doing in life. Then it'll be an instant. Like, I'm saying, when y'all get me on a podcast, especially podcasts, you can't just talk about boxing. Like, it's a podcast. Mix that shit up. Talk about, you know what I'm saying? Other stuff, bro. Everybody keep asking up the same questions. So that's why it's born. No, 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 you know what I'm saying? Where is the gym at? I want some easy work. What you mean by that? What's up, Hot? What's up with y'all? Man, listen. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I was in the car accident a while. Like, on Monday, everybody keep asking me about when I'm fighting. Damn, check up on me. Let me get an interview. Damn. What's up? Who just said that? Like, damn. And I don't duck no smoke. Like, y'all tripping. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all ain't saying nothing. Like, I got chill. Come on, Dubai. We out. We out. All right, now check this out, guys. If you're looking to repair eczema scars, burns and bruises, dark spots and blemishes, the fever blisters, diabetic ulcers, this right here is the perfect product for you guys. It's called L.O. Key Face and Body Oil. Athletes and top-ranking boxers, they're also using it after training to reduce swelling, inflammation, and to ease the pain. So get yours today. Go to LODeKey.com. Like them on Facebook and follow them on Instagram. Let me tell you guys about Issa Israel Law Firm. It is a full-service legal practice based in Denver, Colorado, an emerging hub for combat sports and high-altitude training. If you're a fighter inside or outside of the ring and you need a law firm you can trust to fight for you, visit thefighterfirm.com or email help at iilawfirm.com. Legal representation is usually limited to plaintiffs or defendants in Colorado, but iFirm can help anyone in the world with trademarking their business name, logos, and U.S. immigration issues. This brother has been my attorney for a while and helped guide me through all kinds of business and civil issues, so make sure you guys go to thefighterfirm.com.